Here I have Panasonic Aldo GetUp and let me show you how to accomplish here the setup process on the following device. So at the very beginning let's start by using the home screen here I need to use the desired language as you can see. This is the full list of available languages that you can use on this device. In my case let me choose English for instance from United States. So here you can also choose emergency to make some emergency calls or you can leave it. Now let's go next by using the following button right here. You can insert here SIM card, but you can also activate your device without the SIM card. So let me do it that way. Let me don't here input any SIM card. Now you can connect your device to a Wi-Fi. It's also not necessary, but I usually recommend this step because you can do more of your internet access. So let me connect my device to my Wi-Fi. Here we need to enter the password, so let me do it. Alright, if you enter your password, now you are ready to tap connect right here. The phone is obtaining IP address and this can take up to two minutes because the device is checking connection. Then if everything will be alright, you will go next. Excellent, so here you can decide that you would like to copy your Google accounts, app data and some other uh, important information or you can choose no thanks and have a fresh start so let me choose no thanks let me have a fresh start tap next then let's wait a couple of seconds here you can sign in into the google account it's also not necessary but in my case let me do it let me just enter the email all right then tap next Afterwards, you need to enter the password. So now let me do it. Let me just enter the password to my Google account. If everything will be all right, you will need to tap next. So let me do it next. Here, let me tap agree to terms of service and privacy policy. And now let's leave the following Google services enabled in my case, because here you can decide either you would like to enable or disable automatically backup device data, help apps find your location, improve location accuracy and help improve your Android experience. In my case, let me leave all of them enabled. Now it's time when you can set up the payment information. In my case, let me choose no thanks and tap continue. That's it, the phone is now checking a few information. Here you have to decide either you would like to add another email or you can use the one from your Google account. So in my case, let me choose not now. Here you can also protect your device by using the fingerprint protection or pin pattern or password. In my case, let me choose no thanks for now. Choose skip, skip anyway. Just wait a couple of seconds and here you can decide if you would like to restore apps and app data from one of these devices. In my case, let me choose don't restore. So right now the welcome panel pops up so it means that everything went well you just activate your device thank you for watching please subscribe our channel leave thumbs up under the video